Let's just prep some of those uh, dispel spells here. Could be very useful to have around here because I think the moment I step on these bastard wooden thingies, I'm gonna fall down and my friends down there, they don't wanna let me go. They want me to stay down there forever. But let's see, let's check the map. Oh, look at that, here's the praying hole from hell. Ah, oh, yes, 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 yes. Good, 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 good. Let's carefully move inwards here. Oh, I think I remember this. <laughs> the table always spins away from me. Oh, uh, yeah. Bit of a puzzle. And it's the final piece of the um, thingy. Oh, I don't remember what you have to do here. I don't think it's particularly hard though, or maybe I'm misremembering. Let me just check the the walls here. Ugh, sticky spider web. And nothing. There's hardly any secrets in this game, at least so far. That's a shame, I like secrets. So maybe if we put something Yeah, that doesn't work. Could we put it? No, hang on. We're gonna have to trick this damn table. Uh, and I can't spin the table right or move it in any way. No, I cannot. Oh, what's the trick here? Uh, when all else fails, try explosions. Unless, of course, you're a really rubbish uh, magic user. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't even hit it, right. But you did gain a level, so that's nice. What did you get? Some more wisdom and anti-fire, well that's nice. And probably some more hit points and stuff as well, and more mana, more importantly. So how do we do this? Nope. <laughs> that doesn't work. Mm, nope. Am I just missing something stupidly obvious here? Uh, I'll figure it out. I'm just gonna go, oh, go out here and hopefully not fall down a hole. But I do want to go down here. We're just gonna go down and see if we can deal with our ever so friendly ghost buddies down here. Now, if you don't mind, would you just materialize in front of me, please, uh, so I can blow you up horribly what oh, they do take damage from that so oh they do make a lot of damage I don't feel quite ready for this maybe we should try and come up with some oh look at that Primo has taken they do attack the back row I was starting to wonder about that because Maybe they have an AoE because Olivia took damage as well. That's kind of why I keep losing you guys, because I think some of the enemies will attack you even though they're in front of you or in front of, of uh, Kevin and Dee. Ah, uh, yeah, sorry about that. I'm, oh, God, what the frick? Yeah, eat an axe, son. Primo just gained a priest devil. That's nice too. Let's see what we got here. Oh, we didn't gain anything here. Interesting. But we, yeah, we, I'm sure we got some health and stuff. So that's always useful. Let me just check the health situation. You've got 139 and you've got 101, which is pretty damn miserable. We're going to have to work on that, I think. But let's prep some uh, slightly more powerful versions of the dispel spell. And let's equip both of these guys with Vorpal Blades. I'm determined to get these filthy spook skeletons to just bite the dust. Oh, crud. Whoa, that was damn effective. Let's just go up again heal a little bit because Primo again is taking damage. 
But I think that one, uh, that particular spell was pretty effective. Let's uh, cast it again. Oh, Olivia doesn't have enough mana. Oh, bummer. Okay, down we go again. Show yourselves, please. Oh, gain the wizard level. Good times. Let's just get back up and see. I want to see what we gained. Ah, it's not bad. A little bit of wisdom and some anti-magic. Anti-magic is always good. I'm back! You bony, floaty bastard. Gotcha! What the... Oh, fuck, that's a stinking ball of misery. <laughs> Let's see if we can maybe figure out these doors here. While I have some time. Ah, there we are. Ow! What do we have here? Maybe we should just do a little bit of healing. Because I don't trust the spawn mechanics of this game. We have a funky looking potion. And that's it. I was looking forward to be exploring a big flipping dungeon, but nope. There's nothing here. It's just super empty. I don't think there was anything in here either. It was just the um, the boots, right? Leg plate, yeah. That's just you can carry that, Olivia. I just check the walls. Oops, let's not stay there. We know what happens when there's an evil door. All right. That wasn't too much exciting stuff. I'm a bit disappointed, but I kind of think I remember this, that this dungeon was just super short and it's, yeah, it's disappointing, really. Well, yeah, let's just uh, do some more busy work because, yeah. <laughs> oh, another priest level. That is sweet. Add a priest. Nice, nice, nice. So, I suppose there's not really too much else to discover in this area. We could go back. Oh, God, you. You. Yeah, I forgot about you, all right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. How do you like such things? Oh, these guys. These guys are so annoying. Takes forever getting them destroyed. They don't make too much damage. Let's just back away carefully here. Because I think again Primo is in a bad place and he's hungry as well. I mean this this guy, he eats like a piranha with some sort of metabolical issue. Oh, don't tell me I forgot the food. Should be in here though. Yeah, it's fine, it's fine. Alright, Primo, have a steak for God's sake, suck on that. Maybe you want to put on these? Oh, he's encumbered. Damn. Well, let's have to wait with that for a bit. Or maybe we can... Let me see. Maybe we can figure it out. I shouldn't be... I shouldn't be too hasty here. Let's try and work it out. We can move the shield to Olivia. Here we go. That's nice. Okay, back onto the breaches once again. And maybe we should just prep... Let's do the, the beastly one. Hey. Yeah, that hurt, didn't it? Yeah, that's pretty damn effective. Let's prepare another one of those. I think that it will eat up most of uh, Primo's uh, mana, though. I'm just going to explore this way because I don't think I really did that. Say hello to my new axe. Yeah, it's uh, pretty effective. Gee. Wow, yeah, this is uh, <laughs> crazy. Yep, eat it. Yeah, there's another tree behind me. Should we maybe just make it into Kindle? 
And no, I'm not talking about that uh, reading tablet. <laughs> Although maybe that would be nice too. No, don't, don't run away. Don't run away. Oh, there's an apple here. That is good. I like that. Oh, there is maybe something interesting here as well. So, yeah, let's just um, grab that. I wonder if there's anything out in the uh, the marshlands. I don't think so, right? Nah. But let's go in here. Oh, yeah. Oh, hang on. Is this the graveyard? I think it is, yes. Yeah, it is. All right. I got a little bit too excited there. Uh, suck on that. Oh, wrong button. Oh man, the Warple Blades are so weak sauce. So any way to upgrade these? <laughs> the Warple Blade version 3 or something? Yeah, I suppose it's the uh, pretty weak wizard levels. Maybe that makes this take just about forever. But I think the fighter level will also affect the... Uh, the success here. Maybe you should have both high fighter and wizard levels to get this to really work well. Yep, you're a goner. So how about if we just see if we can eliminate the last one with a spell. I don't know if it's enough to just stand next to the um, graves to trigger them or if they just kind of appear, appear randomly I suppose oh god yes you guys you just never oh no I mm. sometimes I still get confused I get go too close to them and yeah that is bad ah. Ah. Uh, let's just deal with this guy. It's going to be good. Oh, yeah, we gained a wizard level, Kevin. Yeah, there we go. So let's see, Kevin, what did you get? You got a little bit more wisdom and some more mana, and now you're a craftsman wizard. You're not completely garbage anymore. So I suppose there's nothing really left to uh, find here either then. That's a bit of a shame. I think I found all the other areas so maybe we should just head back I suppose. Yeah let's just go back and oh my god you you again. You don't really do much damage, and you're also completely random with your firing. So maybe we can get this done in a reasonable time frame. Then we can deal with the... Skellingtons here. They should be easy pickings with these lovely new... Swords. I mean, axes. Same, same, but different. And stop scratching your butts. It's filthy. <laughs> Okay, so let's just, no, not that way, this way, should head back I suppose to, um... <laughs> oh my god, head back to town and do something, I'm not entirely sure what, yeah we should open up or, okay hang on, yeah okay relax, I'm just gonna feed the eating machine here and I want to find more secrets damn it but there's hardly any secrets in the game it's rather sad I think we should be heading home if we go this way right oh god oh jeez someone encumbered oh yes yes of course it's D carrying this thing 
Yeah, let's just head back to town and maybe grab some axes we can sell because, yeah, I suppose. Oh, why don't you hike up your pants? No, don't you be nicking my stuff. And of course he nicked my axe. I'm not going to let you go. I'm not going to let you get away. I was not paying attention there. I was just like... Give me back my Vorax, you filth monger. Oh yeah, I don't, don't, don't. Oh, I think he nicked something too. Wow. Could you just let me get out of here? Give me back my Vorpal Blade. Yeah, let's just crawl back to the teleportation pad. I think it's over here, right? Yes, yes, yes. And we are back in town. So I'm just going to head over to the tower and insert that last piece of the puzzle. So this might actually mean that I'm nearing the end of the game. I I don't really remember uh, how the game ended, except that it was just crazy short. I was just like, what? Is it over already? And I have a feeling it might be in here where this it's kind of the final thing. But yeah, let's just... Uh, what did I do? Put the... The thingy. Oh, uh, sorry, I didn't get it. It's that puzzle with the stupid table. Oh, yeah, sorry, I'm confused. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, sweet jeebus. Okay, that's better. <laughs> 122 damage. That's more like it. That's more like it indeed. Oh, that was actually nice. I gave him my uh, money box before I sold the item to him and he actually didn't return it until he put in the money, hopefully, at least, that he owed me. <laughs> That's uh, pretty nice. They seem to have put in some effort into this. I'm not sure if it's mentioned in the manual, though. So that's kind of weird. Suppose we could go out and hunt some uh, steaks because uh, we need some food to bring along here. Otherwise, I'm not sure what to do right now. I think I've done most of the stuff that needs to be done, really. Because, yeah, it's... I don't think I've missed anything. Maybe I have, though, if you know. Please let me know. Otherwise, I'm going to have to go back to that silly table and figure out how to fix, fix it or solve that puzzle. But before we do that, let's just do a little bit of hunting because I'm curious to see how effective the the Vorax is going to be against these guys. These absolute beasts of a, of a lunch. Yeah, that's making very short work of them. I suppose there were a couple of um, things left to explore in the wolf area, but I'm not sure how to get past those pits. If there's like a flying spell or something, I don't think there is, but yeah, I, I am not sure how to deal with that. But, hmm. Oh god, we are super encumbered. Surprisingly few beasts in here. Oh, here they are. Are you hiding from me? What is wrong with you people? All I want to do is to turn you into a tasty treat. Yeah, these axes. I approve. Awesome equipment. I think we can just leave these on the ground because they'll be fine. They're not going to spoil. Let's just go back to that silly table, shall we? Because I can't come up with anything better to do. Oh, what a mess this place is. Ah, uh, okay. You easy pickings, bone face. Yeah, I hear you. 
Bone Scratcher. Also, the oh no, what am I doing? I've already had a spell prepared. Let's cast Light with D instead. Can you manage that? That's very good indeed. So let's go in here and avoid the silly holes. All right, I'm just going to save. I'm trying to position my hand exactly where the thing is going to be. But no, oh please, I am busy. Don't you see I'm trying to fix this puzzle here? So I'm trying to put my hand there and just leave the mouse pointer. Uh, I don't think I can do that. It's going to be something more to this puzzle, I think. Nope, that won't work. I can't even spam it. <laughs> and if spam doesn't work, then God knows what will work. Maybe if we put something really stupidly heavy, like, I don't know, chest full of, full of meat. <laughs> Pretty heavy stuff, right? Yeah, here we go. Is that gonna work? How much does it weigh, by the way? 10.4 kilos. Alright, fair enough. Nope. This table is strong. <laughs> I wonder if possibly we could use time stop. Because I have one magical box, right? Uh, let's try it and see what we can do with it. It's got freeze and this thing. Ah, oh, I haven't seen that before. I'm going to have to figure out what that is. But let's just try freeze and I have saved, so... Uh, I don't want to waste my magical Ooh. box and, jeez, all that meat. <laughs> let's just put myself there. Freeze! Nope, this table is... Uh, is uh, quite beyond space-time here. <laughs> it doesn't exist in our timeline. I bet this is something stupidly simple. I mean, really, really stupidly simple. Hmm, let me just have a long think about this. You know what, guys? I am getting pretty tired, so I'm thinking I'm going to call it quits for this session, and I'm going to give this a, a stab another day after I get some rest and I bet I'm gonna just figure this out when I sleep tonight so uh, yeah anyway guys I hope you enjoyed this uh, episode of uh, let's play Dungeon Master 2 and uh, thanks for watching and all that stuff and uh, hope to catch you as always in the next video cheers